What's good, y'all? Um, I'm waking up today, not too much energy. I could not get any sleep last night. Um, all afternoon, all night, and even this morning, I have a throbbing migraine. It's really messing me up right now. Um, I took a few pills like Excedrin migraine, and it's still coming through, man, and I'm not trying to mess myself up inside, internally, so... I gotta figure a way to figure this out. Um, maybe I'll pop a few more pills when I, I get some food. Mystery girl is coming over to bring me some food and um, I'll let you know how it goes. Believe my food is here. What's that? Mm. I've been at it, I've been moving with a purpose Show respect to execution If I got it, I deserve it, let them know Every day I go hard cause I want it all This was all hard work, luck was not involved You know Mystery Hi. Hello. You're not recording for real. Oh my gosh. Hello. It's tuck time. I've been at it. Don't, don't. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I must. I thought I couldn't go to sleep because I was watching the Fear of the Walking Dead or whatever. But then I turned it off, and I just laid in bed like, I'm not tired. I heard you, I was like, damn, it's you the woman. So, oh, I sent you some things. <laughs> you know I do this. I save things to send you later. Mm -hmm. And last night, because I couldn't go to sleep, I saved so much shit. So you're gonna get a lot of shit. Okay. I sent you some already. Oh. <laughs> oh. How did you find that? Man, that was funny. Her little strut after like. <laughs> I wanna do that. You wanna do it? How would you do so? I would get the little bodysuit put on a nice little outfit. And I'd be like, they don't make bow like it does. Um mannequins. Whoa, ooh, that one's sexy. Wear pants. The pants one would work. She was very slacks. skinny. She was. <laughs> like she was as skinny as the mannequin. Like she looked like bro. Ooh, but it was funny. I got you some zaz. Some zaz. They actually finished it in like 20 minutes, but I was still on the phone with health insurance. Oh. It's so it's cold. It, no, it's not cold. I know. I can feel it. It uh, they open at 11. I called like at 11 before 11:30. Mm. Yeah, so you got it fresh. And it was witty. It was witty. You got it fresh, fresh. Freaking um, yeah, how the turns out? Already, I, I felt so good. They was witty. Yes. Um, I have the one. Apparently, my job covered it up until the end of this month. Mmm. So I just extended it. Let's see. Do you smell the coffee breath? I smell everything. No, no, like you smell the coffee breath for real. Because mm. I'm gonna. I mean, of course you smell the coffee, it's right there. It's it smells like elementary school. It was to the point where I smelled the coffee, because my mom brew co brews coffee every morning, and I was awake for her brewing the coffee. And I was like, damn, I really didn't sleep. You didn't need that. That's my dentist room. Mm hmm. Fucking was in too. I tried to pull it out myself. Shut up. It didn't work. Mm -mm. Maybe my 
had it worse. I've had, I had my top wisdom tooth removed. I was scared out of my mind. I did so much research. There's bottom wisdom too? There's two, there's four. One, two, three, four. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> There's bottom wisdom teeth. You better stop. You knew this. Well, there is. That's right. Mm-hmm, it's got dark. You There's know, a scar now. I got a, I had a scratch right here yesterday. Mm -hmm. What the freak? It's like, shh. That's yeah. not by you. My you don't rub with me. I feel like you don't have nails to do that. That was like a precision, like, shh. You ever wake up with scratches? I heard that's, that's something, though. Me too. Whoa, that snapback? How the hell did... Look at Shadow. How he is in my room. Okay. How did he get on the back porch? Oh. The door's not open. He's gonna jump. <laughs> He's gonna jump. I got a suicidal cat. He's going. Maybe somebody opened the back door. There's nobody in the house. Wait, isn't that your mom's car? Yeah, they took Jazz car. What is he doing? Yo! He does this often, doesn't he? Is it a boy? Oh, it is a girl. <laughs> I'm good. I'm good on that. Uh, hey, yeah. No man looks like that. Yes, he does. Marvel. He Look. looks like Stanley. Yes. And he looks like, um, what's his name? Not Wes Craven. Freddy Krueger. Oh, the guy with the big nose. Yes. Um, why can't I think of his name? I love him. Yeah, you do love him. Frank Bart. Oh. Why can't I think of Freddy's name? You know who I'm talking about. I do. Wes Craven. No, no, that's the writer. Robert England. Yes. Because our mailman. Okay. Is famous. I feel like a detective. I'm camping out. I was scouting like a criminal. You know, when they come out, they raise their camera and take a bunch of like pictures in black and white. Hmm. You, see, you see your life as a movie. My life is a movie. What do you want for your birthday? Give me five things you would want for your birthday. I'm not like a materialistic person. Though. I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> so That's why it's like, whoa, what the hell does she want? What does she talk about? Five things. Something adventurous. Something adventurous, I think I have that. Or... Something that requires you wear a helmet. <laughs> <laughs> you always got a helmet on on your birthday. Except for last year. But, oh yeah, because it couldn't go... Uh, uh, Paris, not Paris anyway, I did that. The, what is it? Zip line. No, no, no. Zip lining was, climbing. It, it was in the water. No, I thought you were supposed to go zip lining. Zip lining was because the water one didn't work out. Oh, wow. And it was easy, like zip lining's right there in Canton. It's like 50 bucks. Oh. Um, oh my gosh, white water rafting. White water rafting. Mm -hmm. They gave me the wrong price. They told me it was 100, and I called them to put the money in. I got to raise money. It's like at least six people give me their money. And it's like, okay, so that'll be two something per person. And I'm like, y'all told me a hunt, like, I said white water rafting. Two, 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 two something? Cause they were like, the, the one that I was paying for was a like beginner, like the water is calm. Like everyone's just sitting in the water. I don't wanna uh -huh. do that. 
Or you wanted the wild Yes, I want to hold on to the thing like <laughs> You want to tip over and lose somebody Why you gotta do that? <laughs> Nobody was gonna get lost I got lost Did I tell you what happened to me when I was little? Oh Tell me again So I'm about I want to say like Maybe six years old, maybe four. I don't know this. Mm -hmm. I don't know this story. Mm -hmm. We go to Water Country, my mm -hmm. family. Jazz is like an infant. She's somewhere with my grandfather. And they have these big tubes the whole family could fit on. Mm -hmm. So it's like me, my dad, my mom, and my sister Shakia. And we're on this big tube or whatnot and we go down this slide and you know when you hit the water it like splashes or whatnot so we're, we're going no no no. we're on the same tube i know who the, how is it or is it just like a it's like a circle so, oh it's a circle okay yeah yeah it's a circle like mm -hmm. an inner tube mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and we're sliding down this slide is like super fast and we hit the water on the bottom and it kind of stops the momentum because it like right. hits a lot of water. Yeah. And I fell through the middle of the inner tube and I thought I was gonna die. Then I just felt like a hand grab me by the back of my neck and pull me back and sit me on the inner tube. Who was the hand? My father. <laughs> he was fucking jacked. He just, well not that he had to be jacked to pick me up at the time. I but know, but just, he yeah. Just, I felt like a little cub. Yeah, the fact that, yeah, you were a little cub. <laughs> Water all over my oh, face. Oh, baby Shay. That baby that thought he got shot. <laughs> no. <laughs> What's up, y'all? If you're wondering how I'm eating, how I'm eating, I'll show y'all. This is from Zaz. Okay, we got barbecue sweet chili jerk chicken some vegetables you know you got your sauce you pour over the rice it's looking real good we about to get into it what's good y'all it's turk i'm here with a nice little mukbang for you you know i got my sauce almost dropped that okay pour it over the rice like so again this is Zaz from high park I'll leave their IG in the description. You judge it for yourself. The food is is pretty dang bomb. My camera died in the car, so whatever I edit, if it ended abruptly in the car, it's because my camera died. I ain't even know. I should have had the screen flipped over. I should have seen it coming, but I didn't. You guys could tell me I'm a rookie YouTuber but it is what it is mm. so entanglements how do you guys feel about that <laughs> comments DM to be honest a lot of ladies think a lot of men is mad and sensitive um, I don't think dudes are sensitive. It's just funny. When ladies get played, everybody has a certain energy. When a guy gets played, it stops being sensitive. So it's like, they care more about the, the gender more than the action itself. So nobody's mad at Jada. I think men are more mad at the energy that you guys have towards it, so. I want to know who you guys' favorite YouTubers are. There's a couple guys that I would love to hang with. i love to hang with. Because honestly, they remind me of my friends back at home. If I had a number one person I would want to meet is Ken. Ken from, you know, zk 4 l Ken Deere. He's so laid back, he remind me of myself. 
and honestly my friends he's pretty cool I think he's hilarious and he doesn't overexpose himself and um, I know he's a little younger but honestly that's the type of energy I would love to be around um, true inspiration regardless so I would love to hang with Ken um, number two I would say uh, Clarence NYC he's he's cool he laid back he chilling he be minding his own business I know people trying to help with him but honestly if he was still dolo people wouldn't bother him they only bother him as much is because he's with Queen and Queen came up on YouTube with Chris that's how I see it so a lot of people on his back because they still haven't accepted the fact fully that Queen is off to better things. So, I mean, leave that man alone. That whole thing about the kid, I'm telling you, every guy says it. The day I have a son, I'm going to say it. Number three, I would like to meet CJ So Cool. Uh, I wasn't personally always a fan of him, but my daughter is very much so. So I check out his content and yo, he's doing his thing. He's hustling. He's hustling. And uh, that brings me to my next person. Um, I would like to meet the Prince family. Now, I'm telling you, for the longest time, I would oversee their videos. I see their thumbnails. I would see them pop up often. I tried to watch them once, and I thought it was so cheesy. I couldn't. I could not watch it. It was so corny to me. And recently, actually, this week, maybe even two days ago, I watched their documentary, and I see how they came up, and it just opened my eyes. Like, wow, like. They're, they are cheesy. That doesn't change. But they're not cheesy just to be cheesy. Like, they're hustling. Like, they're hustling. So that's what's up. I fuck with it. You gotta make your money. Um. Yeah, those... Those young kids are hustling. And it's really a motivation for me. Or whatnot, so I'm not hating on them. I just don't. Me personally, I don't enjoy like the fake pranks. They're clearly acting, but I respect the hustle. They're hustling. That's dope. Like, make your money. I wish to make money like that, and they super young. So, I mean, I, I, trust me. I, I believe I'll get there one day. I believe I'll get there one day. Um, and I will. It might take me a little while. I'm starting late in the game. I'm still trying to figure this YouTube stuff out, but when I get there, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go, trust me. You guys are gonna love it. Um, I'm still getting better in front of the camera as far as like my personality. I really thank you guys. Like, if you get to know me, know me, and I catch my moments on camera, you guys are gonna love it. Uh, <laughs> I'm a funny ass nigga. Hate to put it like that, but I am. Another person I want to meet is DDG. He's cool. He's cool. I mean, everybody I'm naming is cool, but like, he seems like a cool ass dude. Um, he goes through a lot of drama with these women, though. Um, but that's none of my business. That's him and uh, shit. He making money. And as you guys know, more money, more problems. So hell yeah. I have more problems. 
and my bills ain't one of them. I fuck with DDG. All these young guys, motivated. I wish I started earlier. I wish I listened. I wish I listened uh, earlier on. So, yeah, man. First McBang, this is like on the fly. I didn't know I was coming here doing. I just know it's another day and I need another video up. I'm keeping my promise to y'all. This food is really helping me with my migraine. But that's it, you guys. I'm Sir. No, I'm out. Dad, what's wrong? My life's a TV show. Here's another episode. Sticking to the script, swear I'm always skeptical. Starring me, 